like, what do you mean you're a conspiracy theorist? Like, what do you believe? She's got him up in the air. Yes, spin him. Let him feel the way that no other woman has ever let him feel. Let him feel carried. Wait, I think our friend just died. You did not set something on fire. I said, get out my house, up out my face, get out my house. Get out my house, up out my face, get out my house. We did it, y'all. It is no longer a haunted house. The tip of the tongue, the teeth, the lips. The tip of the tongue, the teeth, the lips. Okay. To all of you beautiful souls, hello. And to all of you without souls, hey. Hi. You're not an afterthought. In fact, I find you to be the most fascinating part of this whole equation. And I would love nothing more than to get to know you better. Speaking of getting to know people, if you're wondering who I am, you're not alone. I'll let you know when I know. My people will call your people. So have your people waiting, okay? For now, you can call me Simoleon. And this is my channel where I say stuff. Stuff like, welcome back to Luna. I already know what happened in the last episode, y'all. Let's not even, let's not even play. Let's just, let's just, let's just get it. I mean, let's play. But like let's not play around let's just get it started you know my girl is having some coffee she's like she has to go to work her barista job we're a bit upset obviously because i don't know why um you know where did our girl go anyway i don't know why but the industry has been kind of messing with our girl it's been kind of messing with our girl you know like she wants to act She's waiting for her chance to shine, and it seems as though that time is escaping her. I love her eyes, by the way. She's got like a little, a little hint of purple in her eyes. Do you see that? And no one wants to let this girl act. No one wants to let her act. Okay. Anyway, she's drinking her coffee. Um, she has work at eight. So let's just check in on her needs. Oh, she's hungry. Well, she can eat at work, babe. Uh, she's also a bit tired, which, you know, unfortunate. I am gonna have her come brush her teeth after the coffee breath, because I'm, I'm not a coffee breath girly, you know? JPeth, is there a reason you're still in the room? Do I need to reset this man? Maybe I'll just like put him away and then summon him again. I should put him away for work anyway. You know, because I feel like I probably can't take him with me. Or maybe I can't. Familiar? Can I? If I summon Familiar, will he then show up? This game is so glitched out. It's wild. Yeah, could you summon him? Thank you. Oh, there he is. Is your. Oh, that's so creepy. Why is he stuck there? You know? But is our J Beth still here? Perfect. All right, so today, honestly, I just want stuff to be chill today. I think she's gonna go to work, put in some energy, put in some effort, and I want her to like kind of hang out with Penelope after. And I don't know, they should just have a little girl's day. I think she deserves it. Her audition for her next job is tomorrow at 5.37 a.m. before she has to go to work. And y'all, you know, do I have cats? Yes, two of them. Do they make noise? Oh. Yes, they do. Do I have neighbors upstairs above my head? Yes. Do they make noise? <laughs> yes. Do I make noise? Sometimes. Hey girl, what are you up to? Oh, thank goodness she's getting leftovers. I hated when roommates would always just make food unprovoked, okay? So I put in this mod by, I believe, Little Miss Sam where they prefer leftovers. Gidri, are you still here? Do you just hang out even though my house isn't haunted? Oh, we got a death medal. I love that. 
She's like, it's a mess in here, Gidfrey. Why wouldn't you help? Support his facial hair. Well, girl, it's your fault it's a mess. You also need to repair this. Do a quick repair you before you have to go to work. Oof. I need to move this over to there because this is also broken. Yeah? We did it! Okay, one spell successfully done. I, I need us to find another familiar before the week is... Before Wednesday, though. Right? Is it Wednesday that we change our familiars? I believe so. And we have two days. Okay, go, go to work. Go to work. Go to work. Go to work. Stop all this. Discuss companion planting? Absolutely not. Go to work. You want to joke about body hair. Stop talking to the ghost. You're going to be late. Thank you. JPeth, could you like hurry her along sometimes? Thank you. Yeah, you better wear your barista outfit. And somehow Apache is still not being helpful. We need to stop doing magic on our plants for a bit until we increase our magic skill. Because, girl, it's not working. We need to read some books. We need to, you know, we've been focusing so hard on the acting career, which is, you know, fair because that's what she wants to do with her life. But I think we need to pay a good amount of attention to magic because we're going to need that to cope. And as you know, because it's eight, I'm going to allow her to, ooh, girl, you got to come home and dig that. I'm going to allow her to, uh, you know, ooh, work hard, work hard, girl. I think she's like set up for the day. Don't schmooze with your boss for nothing. Just work hard. And let's see. Ooh, hey, girl. What are you up to today? I'll just follow you around until I have to change up Luna's schedule. I like Gwen a lot. Let me see what her traits are. Oh, I can't even open that. Never mind. I'll just I'll, I'll just follow her, I guess. What do you think of the decor? Do you like the hanging branch over there? Are you a fan? She's not really clarifying. At least our house isn't haunted anymore by those things, and that is all that matters to me. However, cats are back. Hey, ninja. You're allowed in, right? You guys are allowed in. Allow access for I'm tired of always saying this missy and ruby no what about ninja and simon these are the goats you guys can come in right hi ruby okay i've opened the door oh she met a new friend nalini nalini while at work nice okay that's cool we could hang out with her sometime i also have to start thinking about a name for the coven that luna's gonna start because even though we are part of coven original name victoria we just want to steal these people and take them somewhere else also i don't want to be casting spells all the time because that runs up the charge and that's how victoria runs things but that's not how i'm gonna run things so you're gonna have to wait and see you know hey cats you can come in do i have to unlock this door fine it's unlocked come in and out as you please okay Ooh, Simon's in the house. He's sussing everything out first. Oh, we met Savannah at work. Wow, we're meeting some really cool people. I'm excited. Okay, I'm guessing rush hour is dying down now. So let's, we can socialize with coworkers. It seems like you're making a lot of friends anyway. You know? I feel like it's probably going to be hard to mix and mingle with the elites of this world. The elites, the actors and stuff. But we don't care. We're just building our own small community of people. We're not doing this that way. Since apparently they don't even want us to come in and, you know, schmooze our way to the top, then fine. Missy. Missy's loving, loving this candle. Yeah? Mm-hmm. And then what happened? Oh, I think we met an actor at work. Who's Logan? We should talk to Logan. He's also a barista trying to make it in the acting world. Yeah, we met Cody. Okay, let's take it easy. There's like too many people we're meeting. Oh my gosh, you guys, Patchy's. Oh, y'all, look who it is. Look who showed up. It's Patchy. Patchy, 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 Patchy. Hey, Patchy, where are you going? Patchy, don't run from me. Patchy. Patchworth. What's happening? Patchy. Okay. Missy, you better tell him. I mean, oh, what is there to be said? Apache is doing some centering yoga. I think he's having a hard time. Like, it's just like, it's been very haunted in here. He's alive for the very first time. 
and he just you know he needs to unwind i don't know how he knows about yoga but he's probably just heard them talking about it or something so i understand i get it patchy you better go off he made 90 dollars today what a what a shame what a shame totally okay i'm gonna have you first of all could you come in and say hi to patchy he's not doing so hot just come check in on him okay make sure he's doing okay Oh, you're not even like friends with him. Why don't you be cheerful? Like really ease his concerns. Patchy! Is it the cat you're scared of? What on earth is Patchy scared of? Look, 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 look. Ninja, you're talking nonstop, okay? I'm hungry. What should I eat? Your face. Your face. Hey, JPEG, how was work today? Yo, yo, Ninja, it's like nonstop with you. It's nonstop. I need you to like figure it out, okay? Look, if I fill all your motives, maybe you'll stop. Pachi, you okay? Okay, well, I have to take a nap because I have to go out with Penelope real soon. So, power nap. Thank you. And then we have to come change our outfit. Is our roommate here? Well, she's asleep. Okay. A little midday nap. I love that for you, Gwen. Gwyneth. Gwendolyn. Gwenisha. Okay. Stick a little power nap. Okay, that power nap helped a little bit. You're still here talking to Patchy. We don't have the time, girl. We don't. I need you to come change your outfit. Was that screaming? What's going on? Okay, could you come put this on, please? Patchy, stop freaking out. You're a scarecrow. How do you not know that you're just as scary as all the other things in here? How do you not know that? Oh, wait, wait. Where, why is she running? What is she scared of? She's scared from being screamed at. Yeah, Patchy, could you do less of that, please? Did you hear that from being on possessed ground? I know, y'all. Y'all, there is a ghost here. So it's like there's probably a couple ghosts. No, we're gonna go get a tattoo. Yes. Just like a tattoo, I'll always have you. Okay, this is by a deep indigo. Let's go to the tattoo parlor, my love. Hopefully we can go with Penelope. Maybe she goes for emotional support. Ooh, should we shave our legs soon? Maybe. Choose a permanent tattoo. Yes, 150 bucks. Let's do it, okay? This industry is gonna be like, oh, we don't want you to like be covered in, Patchy, could you not? We don't want you to be covered in tattoos and Well, you know what? Don't tell me what to do. Patchy, stop running around my house. It's excessive. JPS, do you have any ideas on tattoos we could get? Or no? All right. All right, let's get our girl her tattoo. Let's do this. We're not gonna do leg tattoos today just cause we didn't clear the landscape and that's fine. Not body hair. Let's give her, I can't believe she doesn't have any tattoos. Normally I would give my Sims a bunch of tattoos. This underwear is by Tay. Mine comes with this, it has this line, but I don't even care, girl. I'll just say that that's, you know, you know when your, uh, your bikini line is extending past your underwear, child? That'd be happening. So it's okay. Let's figure out what kind of tattoo we want today. Hmm. Should we get a face tat? Are we there? No. It has to make sense though. Okay, so this is really cute by Frenchie Sim. Is, is she a floral girly though? I don't even know. I don't know. This is a bee. Ooh, this is kind of cute. Let's take a look at this. Okay, so she could get a little bee. It has no significance to her though. She'd get a, a swarm of bees. What is that? Oh, this is like butterflies. Is that what that is? Oh, that is cute. I kind of like the butterflies. Or she'd get them on her chest. Do I want a colored tattoo though? I don't know if I want her to- Ooh, be like that's the one. Look at that, it's a moon. It is a moon. Now it's a question of do I want it on her shoulder? Or do I want it down there? What suits you better? I feel like, hmm. Kind of like the shoulder thing. It'll be cute for like, you know, certain like tops and stuff. Do we want a shoulder one? Luna, what do you think? Looks like JPET is just cradled in there. I want it to be exposed, you know? But also something they can cover up when I'm acting it. I feel like shoulder gives the Tyler Posey energy of chaotically getting a tattoo during the filming of Teen Wolf, you know? 
I kind of like that. And like they have to cover it up and stuff. But I believe his was actually down here. So if we're going with Tyler Posey energy, I could put it down here. Yeah. Okay, I think I could, yeah. Well, based on my loose recollection of Tyler Posey's tattoo, I'm gonna say we're gonna go with that Miko tattoo. I like it a lot. Okay, let's get on with our day. We did it, it hurt, it was nice. Let's go. Yay, we got our tattoo. Oh, she's scared to be here. Should we just go hang out with our girly? Should we go get like, we haven't really hung out with her. Could go to like one of those like fancy places or something. We could even take a work friend. Is that what we want to do? Let's look at our little work friends here. Okay, so there's Koti. We just met at work. Nalini, Isabel, and Logan, I think, is an actor. I got this beautiful refurbished Orchid Agogo -go from the gallery. I love it. Look, we got the Abbott Elementary behind us. I love that show. It is so funny. If anyone watches Abbott Elementary, please let me know your favorite character um, in the comments down below. I cannot pick. I cannot pick my favorite character. I'm torn. See, I love me some Tyler James Williams, but Quinta, yeah, I love Quinta, but Miss Lady, <laughs> not she funny. But so is she, child, I can't pick. I cannot pick, but anyway, I love, <gasps> do you guys like Bones? I love Bones. Also, if you love Bones, kindly tell me in the comments below. I love Bones so much. I find that show, like, yes, hilarious, but like, I don't know, I just, the Deschanel's, they, they do it for me. They kind of do. Girls, I want us to sit at this table together please and thank you. We're gonna sit together, okay? I don't know why you're sitting at the bar away from your best friend. They always do this when they hang out. They just like sit separately. I don't like it. I don't like it. I do like the ambiance here though. Ribaza. So I have them talking and now she's telling her about how everything's been going with work. And she's like, I couldn't really tell you at work today, but like, this is getting a bit much. They keep canceling on me. I started a group gathering so that like we didn't really have to deal with her leaving. But she's like, I can't deal with all this. It's a lot. Like every time I have an audition, it either, like it goes well. But then when it's time for me to actually, you know, go in for the day, things keep getting canceled. And Penelope's like, you know what? It doesn't matter because by the time you do get there and start doing what you want to do, guess what? Guess what? Like, there's gonna be cute guys, cute girls, and like, you know, you can you can be charming. You can charm your way in. She's like, how are you feeling working at the coffee shop? And she's like, I feel okay. Like, you know, it is what it is. People are a bit annoying. Like, I just would like to start pursuing my thing like you. She's like, you should start it. Like, I don't see what's stopping you from starting it. Like. I, but again, you know, looking at my experience, it is a bit rough. Um, I'm talking. But it is a bit rough. And Penelope's like, oh my god, I just got a text about like an audition that I want to do. Do you think I should say yes? I absolutely think you should say yes. She's like, I just, I don't think I'm ready. I'm not comfortable with like this stuff as much as you are right now. And Luna's like, I'm barely comfortable. Like, I thought I was ready for this. And they're trying to shatter my self-confidence with every passing day. But he's like, I know, I know. What do we do? Bro, we just have to start. We straight up just have to start going to more auditions. Because it wasn't this hard for all the people before. Was it this hard for Judith Ward? I don't know, you know? What are you guys? Oh, she's tipping? She's tipping him? Well, at least you have the income to do so. Because I, I I may have some money, but I'm not tipping nobody. Considering that this industry is treating me like mess. Sorry. Sorry. Anyway. Can you guys talk to each other or what's happening? Where is Penelope? Babe. Penelope. Babe. Babe. <laughs> Where is Penelope? Oh, what are we drinking? Oh, we're having, oh, you know what? It's six o'clock, you are a grown woman. You are entirely entitled to that. So totally fine. 
Is this the bouncer from outside? He's probably on his break. What's his name? Chandler? Oh, it sounded like she said Chandler at the same time as me. Hi, Chandler. How's it going? Any relation to the Chandler of the Bing variety? Checking out the chain chain name. Your glasses are what? You think I'm pretentious and I think you're grilled cheese. And I don't think we like grilled cheese. It makes us break out. So, no. And he's like, well... Fast food doesn't always make you break out, sir. That's a stupid argument, okay? It usually does. It's fast. It's not the greatest for you. Your food should take time to make. Don't just stare at each other all weird. You know, I'm just happy that my NPCs don't look as weird as they used to because that was a whole problem that I was dealing with once upon a time. Well, Penelope's a bit done with us, so when we're finished drinking our beer, I guess we can call it a day. I love when the last exception has nothing to do with you. What does that even mean? Okay. Yeah, keep talking. Who's calling me? The owls are not what they seem. Who is this? Hey, I'm Batane Wexner. Chandler, are you making one of those jokes? Look, we have to start going home soon. Girly pop. What's going on here? Are you like, are you talking to somebody? Why aren't you interacting with us? Look how this guy is looking at Penelope. Ooh, we have some kind of romance with him. That is incredibly awkward. Could you talk about current events with her, please? She's just kind of like hanging out, just like watching people play piano. I want Penelope to enjoy my company, but she's not. Don't make me invite Willow over here. Bright and day. I'll invite Willow and then I'll make her a bubble tea girly too. Because I wanted us to have a little, you know, us thing. But it's not working, you know? You're giving me a hard time. You don't call me. You know, express desire to go clubbing. No, talk about attracting butterflies. You know what? It's been wonderful to spend time with you. We've made some great memories and we'll make many more. I know that. Yeah, Penelope, I just want to know if you care because it doesn't even show that we have great compatibility. Why are you feeling woo woo? You drunk a little bit? Chandler, we have bad compatibility. She's like, why are you talking to that man? I know. But they do love each other, so you know what? I'll leave it alone. She might just be going through a thing where like Luna is exploring her career right now. And like that may make Penelope feel a kind of way because she might feel like a bit behind because she hasn't made that step yet. However, she's also seeing that Luna is struggling and she wants to be there for her. So I get it. So yeah, we may we won't add Willow to the girlies now. Our friendship got me thinking about how we should live together. Can I move in with you? No about Gwendolyn okay look not now I think that we should live with Penelope at some point but I just feel like at this point in their relationship right like again there's that comparison and if she m moves in I'll have to control her and I'm not ready to do that just yet so I'll say I don't think it's a good idea right now after much deliberation Luna doesn't want Penelope to move in with her right now she's like I love you and I just want to like I don't want to mess up our friendship by living together a lot of best friends like really have a hard time doing that she's like i appreciate it so much that you you know are open with me let's vent about finances vent about finances she's like girl i know i shouldn't live with you you'd be pranking me and stuff you know it you know it sis we have to leave at like eight i want to start getting ready for the day tomorrow what Oh yeah. Oh, he gave us an angel fish. Okay, we gotta take that back to the house. Thanks, JPS, for always giving us. Why is he watching this guy? He's like, we gotta keep an eye on this man. This one's like, I'm starving. I need to go home. I made some yummy fried chicken. I wanna just go home and eat it. You know what, girl? That is fair. That is fair, girly pop. I really want us to live with her. I really, really do. It's just unfortunate that I don't think it's a good time right now. You know, this orchid a go go is not bumping, except for this man. Bako Jang. We know Bako. Wow. For a place that's supposed to be an up and coming hotspot, it is neither up nor coming. So, Penelope, it seems like you have like a very vested interest in Bako. You know, let's talk about celebrities then because before we leave, she's like, you want to you wanna get to know Bako? You know? Chandler, don't look at Penelope don't like that. Penelope does not want to hang out with Chandler. <laughs> okay. Anyway, we have to go home. So let's end this little gathering. Bye, bestie. 
We love you. Chandler, you should absolutely go back to work. <laughs> hi, hi, JPeth. Okay, a couple things we need to do. After our audition tomorrow, I want us to go see if we can get a another familiar, you know? But that, that all depends on a lot of stuff. We have a spotted dirt frog and a regular dirt frog. Okay, so why don't we breed our dirt frogs? That's amazing. And I'm gonna have her go to the Wicked store, actually. And while she's, oh, okay, so we have to get some, let's get some tampons. Um, we should absolutely go on BC. That was an issue. I want us to get, let's get like two chill pills and then a box of doms. Amazing. Ooh, j went, 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 went with us. Wow, you guys. That was rough. That was rough. Okay. So where is my bottle? Oh, it's right here. I don't want it to be right here. I need to, we need to fill that up. Okay. Uh, I got us a little fish tank a while ago. So why can't I put any fish in my fish tank? I don't like it. There's just a little minnow in here. I want a bigger fish tank. That's my to-do list. I want a fish tank where I can put a bunch of fish because this isn't, it's not giving what it's supposed to be giving. I want to be able to grab ingredients freely. Let me see if I can do that. Ooh, I got I got one, y'all. I put it outside because it doesn't fit into our decor anywhere. But maybe I can put... Look, I put all the koi in there. That's amazing. So now every time that our beautiful j gives us a fish, you know what we do? You know what we do? We put it into our fish tank. Okay, why don't we come shave our leg hair? All right. All right, so we'll throw on those pajamas and then we'll figure out something to eat. A zombie Carl. I don't know why he gives us this, but I imagine it's to throw away. Ooh, we have to go there anyway. Um, okay, let's go duel with Lavinia. Life has a way of making us forget the things that matter. But at the end of the day, there is something we eventually desire. No matter what life you lead, it's nice to feel love. And it's nice to show love. So maybe it's time for you and your love to try something new. Surprise your sim with their favorite things. Leave a disturbing amount of rose petals everywhere. There's something so romantic about creating a mess you have to clean up the next day. Let's let these two enjoy their love day. Passionate gifts by Utopia. Treat the ones you love to the things they love. Passionate gifts is a mod made by Utopia and can be downloaded on their Patreon. All questions regarding this mod should be asked directly to them, not to me. Are we clear? I want no miscommunication. The excellence of this mod is not my doing. I wish it was, but it's not. Anyway, all Sims in this commercial were volunteers. They were not paid for their work, but they got to keep the gifts, so there's that. This commercial was voiced using Murphy AI. Okay, looks like it's time for us to do a quick duel before bed. Lavinia? Lavinia? JPeth, where is Lavinia? Are you serious? She just dipped. All right, let's, let's see. Let's see who wins this. I'm very, very curious, honestly. 
What are we thinking? I feel like Lavinia, I don't know, she's kind of a badass. So she might body us, but also we're kind of, we got anger on our side and freshly shaved legs and that should make us more aerodynamic. So who knows? Okay, come on, somebody. Why are they psyching each other out? I have to go to bed. I have an audition in a couple hours. Yes, you better block it. Mortal Kombat, yes. Oop, 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 yeah. Trip her up, trip her up, trip her up, trip her up. I like it. Oh my gosh, I'm scared, I'm scared. Oh my gosh, I'm so scared. I feel like... <gasps> okay, she got the first hit. So maybe we'll win. She got that first hit. That first hit is designed to make us mad, right? She won? We're going home. We're going home. We're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna dig this thing and we're gonna go home. Because how did we just get beat up? Look at that. Agony and defeat. And now you're gonna go over there mad. You know, you're gonna go mad to this, this audition. Come dig this and let's go. It's 11 o'clock. You're only gonna get a few hours of sleep. This is wild. Let's make sure we put on like a cleanser tonight and everything so we don't break out. We found Fosanite. We're going home. Oh my gosh. Okay, now we've missed a lot of things. And you know what? We don't have those little wraith thingies. So why don't we just have leftovers? Okay, she's gonna come have some mac and cheese. We love to see it. Gwen, is everything going okay? How are you doing? Oh God, we have to kick you out at some point. But you know what? Maybe she'll leave on her own. For now, she's doing good. She's happy with her living situation. I don't like that you have this because I find it really annoying, the future cubes. But you know what? Maybe she needs some reassurance that this house is clear of evil spirits. Gwen, did you leave this here? I think you did. And I don't appreciate you leaving stuff here. While Luna eats, we're going to pack her bag. So we have moisturizer. Um, I want us to fill this bottle up. And then we're going to put it into that bag. Oh, we have another fish. Oh my. So many fish, so little time. I love it. I love it for spells. It is just great. Uh, there's a lot that we have to do right now. Okay. So let's unpack. Let's, un <laughs> let's unpack this, please. Okay. So that's been unpacked. We just got a koi. Thank you so much, JPEF. He gives us so much stuff. It really makes it so we don't have to like go far and wide for, oh, there we, there we go, she finished. Okay, when you refill that, um, we're gonna have to also put one of these, oh, they won't go in there? Okay, I guess it'll just stay in your inventory, that is fine. What about these? Can I put one in your bag? I kind of like the idea of packing a little, a little tampon for her. Nope, okay, well, we'll just say that they're in your bag. And then we're gonna go on BC. I think it's very strange that we don't have a, um, no, we need to make sure we set an alarm for tomorrow. Don't just go to sleep. Okay. She woke up at 342. She's going to come clean. She's feeling a lot of stuff. Oh my gosh. Filthy clothes hung over and she has cramps. What a wild way to go to an audition. And she had a nightmare. Oh my gosh. Okay. So you have cramps. We'll take a pill. Um, I kind of, okay, just, how do we get it together for you? We need to put laundry in. Well, first of all, you're already in the garden, I guess. So, or in the greenhouse. So let's plant this and then let's harvest everything we can. Yeah, no more spells in here. Let's just avoid doing that. Then we're gonna have her get ready for the day, so. We have to do some laundry. Oh my gosh, it's filthy in here. This is not even the time. Okay, let's search our pockets for money. And we should have gotten like an ibuprofen or something. It's too late for that. Add this to the washing machine. Thank you. Of course, the cherry failed to germinate. I don't want to hear about it. Just leave it alone. Did we harvest everything else though? I told you to come harvest stuff. She's too uncomfortable. Girl, that is fair. That is absolutely fair. There's nothing we can really do about that though. I'm just gonna have you jump in the shower, I guess. Uh, take a quick shower, brush your teeth. Gosh, she feels a mess. <laughs> She's so hungover. Well, why would you drink last night? I didn't make you do that. This is too much. Oh, this thing is still here. It's still very ugly. Um, it's fine. 
Oh, she's feeling better now. She is feeling a lot better now. Okay, we can do this. We can absolutely do this, y'all. Okay, let's, um, I'm gonna put the cherry out here and then we can plant it. And then I'm gonna have her come harvest everything. That's, that's fine. That's a good start to the morning, you know? JPeth, thank you for all the wonderful gifts you give us all the time. We're gonna have to clean this place. Can we ask someone to clean the house? Her audition starts in an hour, girl. I know, I know it does. Maybe you need to come feel strong before your audition or something. You don't even have time. Well, if you do, then we'll do that. And if you don't, then it is what it is, right? What, what now, what now, what now? Oh, she's showering, okay. I hope we have enough time. This feels like we're kind of... Girl, you better sing. And what is her singing skill at? She has so many skills. She's at one, but she sounds so good in the shower. Girl, you just have talent coming out the huasu. You are not wearing that outfit. Nope, 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 no, 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 no. You are wearing our Barbie girl outfit. Whether this is good or bad luck, it's anybody's guess at this point, but that is what you're gonna be putting on. Our house is so dusty, we have to get this clean. We have to vacuum in our inventory, right? We don't? How are we gonna clean this house? What? Can I breed? No, I can't. Can I breed is crazy. Um, okay. Why did you put this on though? I just told you what to put on. You know, if this is what she wants to wear, it's a cold day, this is what she wants to wear to her audition, I am never gonna be the one to stop her. So. Where that's your audition, that's fine. It's in 20 minutes. We don't really have time to do anything else, but just get out the house and go. Oh, she did change. She's still feeling so bad. She's feeling really uncomfortable. This is not ideal, wait. Wait, 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 this is not ideal. What is she supposed to be feeling to pass this audition? Confident? Oh no, oh no. What do we do? How do we get her confident quickly? Um. We have 10 minutes. Girl, why don't you just go here or something? <laughs> no, I don't know how to get, look, and her performance is dropping. I don't know how to get her to be confident. Oh, she's confident from having a familiar. She just needs to get out of that space. Okay, now you're not in the dirty surroundings. So do you feel a bit better? Look, there's fresh air. Okay, she feels fine. That's not bad. That's not bad. Oh my gosh. I wish she didn't. She feels happy. Then why does she only feel fine? There is some confidence. So maybe that would be good to, you know, carry us. She feels enough confidence in, in like three things. So she should technically be fine. Okay. Good luck, girly. Good luck. You better sashay. Yes. You're a Barbie girl in a Barbie world. Life in plastic is fantastic. Don't text me, I'm at an audition. Oh my gosh, I'm so nervous. Please, I hope she gets it. Imagine she's late to work on top of everything else. <laughs> she won't be, or will she? audition yes well done Luna the role of void critter Volps is yours we noted that you do really well when you, the outfit hides your face you will we will look for more auditions with full head costumes yeah I hate this agency and I would like a different one and she is confident that's great still hungover she's gonna be hungover for how long two hours that's fine it's gonna be the two hours of bringing chaos at the cafe that's great that's what we love to hear go to work Go to work. Go to work. Hey, I'm gonna have her work hard as usual. She met Freddy while at work. You're meeting so many people at work. It's unfortunate that you're gonna have to quit at some point if you ever progress in your career. So our audition is actually, our actual gig is tomorrow. What do you guys say to me straight up going to the gig? 
Like I can power through this day after work. We'll have her go look for a new familiar in the realm of magic and you know, just boom, we're in tomorrow. How's that sound? I'm super down because I don't wanna just wait and wait and wait. Let's see if this industry is really here to play with us. She's so tired. Is there a reason Gwen? I mean, Gwen couldn't clean the house because she didn't have anything to clean the house with, but now you do. So could you try doing that next time? And also, y'all, I don't know. Maybe I talked about this in the tour, but I feel like I probably didn't even talk over the tour. So I wanted to give her a little Rachel Berry wall. <laughs> we don't like Rachel Berry in my house. <laughs> but I like the idea of having a little vision wall of like all the things she wants to see while she's like running on the treadmill and stuff. She got, you know, Nikki and B, she got Riri, she got our queens over here, she got this over here, and she got this over here, you know? If it doesn't open, it is not your door. I don't know who needs to hear that today, but that is the truth, all right? If it does not open, it is not your door. Look for your windows of opportunity. Every time something bad happens, something good is trying to happen too. What's happening? What's she doing? Put away, don't put anything away, come run. Where is she putting it even? Cause you know, I don't, oh, she's, why did you stop putting things in there? We just got this. No, open. Is that where she put it? Yes. Basic witches. <laughs> what book even is that? Okay. Scrubberoo we can absolutely put in there though, because I don't care. This is a master spell, miasma. We're not a master yet. I need to put this koi fish away while she works out. Um, I can't put it in. Oh, maybe it's, oh no, is that a dead koi fish? It's not, okay, cool. Guess we have to put these in the fridge. <laughs> That's really awkward. All right, guess the, fr the the thing is at capacity. All right, fine, I guess. Fine, I guess. Hi, Mr. Koi. So sorry for that. So sorry for just like plopping you on there. I know you're still alive. Um, Are we good on our fitness? Says she hasn't started. Yes, she has. She's absolutely started. Look at this. She's running to her goals. She's like, if I run fast enough, I make it to their spot. I get to do what they're doing. Yes. Huh. Run, 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 run. Run, 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 run. Run, 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 Cause you know, talk to me. <laughs> I love that scene so much. I love that scene so much. Okay, it's 916. What does it mean you haven't started developing your fitness skill? Is that like a joke? Okay, why don't you come do some bicycle crunches? How's that? Because this is not processing that you have actually worked on your fitness skill and I don't like that. She likes fitness. Yay, oh, she did. She did do that. Anyway, it's fine. We should still do a little workout anyway. And then when you're done, you're gonna move your laundry over so that we can actually have clean laundry for once. Yes? Yes? Yes, girl, you better bicycle and you better crunch. Bicycle, crunch, bicycle, crunch. Hey, bicycle, crunch. Oh, let's go now. Uh, 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 and left, right, left, right, left, right, left, right. Let's go now, let's go now, let's go now. What? let's go. I bring the beat back. I think that's a Missy Elliott song, right? <laughs> I think I just saw her face, so I just started doing that. Okay, so when you're done doing your laundry and stuff, let's see how we can get you ready for the day in general, baby. You still have your purse, which still has all of its things in it. I love that for you. Your dragon orb is here. We're gonna put that above your bed so that when you are all done, you can celebrate by, you know, switching out JPEth for this dragon who will have to be named. I'm very excited. I'm very, very excited. I have a feeling I know the name for the dragon, but I need to watch something tonight and make sure I know the name of the thing <laughs> before I change the dragon's name. Y'all, please, I'm weak. Why are there ghosts having a small meeting at my bar? Oh, no, they saw me coming and now... Please tell me someone isn't haunting something in this girl's room. That's gonna upset her so much. Okay. They're haunting my grill and my table, but the other one like ran in somewhere. Please don't haunt anything in Gwen's room. I'm even gonna auto lights her room for her. Auto lights this room. 
But is there like one light that can be on or something? Ah, oh, this poor girl's room is a mess. Should I turn off the dust system? I don't want to deal with all this dust. It's dusty. It's messy. It affects their mood. I'm sorry. Is there a reason that you're like soaking wet in my garage? Why are you leaking? And you're mad it's a mess. You are literally leaking. Emma Coleman, did you die in my house or something? I don't even know. I'm turning off the dust system. No more dust, dust be gone. Oh, she's like, girl, that girl Oh, not the ghosts scaring each other. What kind of meeting is happening in my garage? Y'all imagine if this meeting was happening here. This is a whole congregation of ghosts. This guy has a chicken inside him. Did he die by chicken? Steven, Stephen Cow. Stephen Cow, there's a chicken in you. No one else has anything in them. This meeting is wild to me. This meeting is crazy. Another ghost is just show- Why is everybody hanging- Oh, maybe this is how they died. Maybe he died by evil chicken and she died by electrocution. Charlotte Hartley, that's two celebrities. Proper celebrity and a rising star in my house. Maybe they could give her advice on how to live. Oh, Opalina, bestie, hi. Ah, oh, I cannot believe this happened. At least you get to be friends with the celeb in your death, you know? And they're all in a good mood. The ghosts love it in my house. This is my theory. My theory is if you have ghosts in your house, you know what you should do? Just let them be. Just leave them alone and they won't bother you, you know? Sir, you're tracking water all over my house. I think he died from drowning, probably. Okay, well, I don't want you dragging water. This is my exercise mattress. Like, this is a lot, okay? Oh, he's cleaning it up. You guys, I might have the, ghost, the, the best ghosts in the world. I might. He's cleaning up his water. Make me lose my breath in your water. Trevor Jackson, is that you? Trevor Jackson cleaning your water. I don't know what that was. Why is someone possessing my dumbbell? You know what? No. I think they're trying to do squats in the afterlife. I'll leave it alone. These ones are talking. She's like, I died by electrocution. Of course it was Emma Coleman trying to get in them squats. Do not possess my treadmill. Ugh, these people. And now Emma Coleman is doing what? Yoga. Of course. Of course. The ghosts in my house are unruly. All right, I'm waking Luna up now. Oh, she is not happy. Okay, well, we're gonna have to... <sighs> Could you go use the bathroom, please? Thank you. And maybe get some food. Why can't you have the waffles? Good, she's smart about her BC, and I kind of love that. I really do love that. So first of all, before you go get any food, what's that? Become enemies with James? Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I need to... Why can't I take a vacation day? Colin, someone might catch on. I'm not coming to work today. Like, <laughs> I hope y'all are aware that I am not coming to work. Okay, I'm just gonna skip work. That's crazy. I'm saving this. She wants to become enemies with James. Luna thinks it's about time to make it official. James is terrible and sometimes being enemies is inevitable. <laughs> Click on James and select declare enemy. This interaction is unlocked by performing mean socials to decrease relationship. Who even is James? They actually have amazing compatibility, so that is really weird. Are they on or off? People can never tell. Oh, wow. So they have like a romance, but also they hate each other. That's great. Girl, are you having mac and cheese for breakfast? That is a crazy move when you have to go to set. You're not doing that. We have to eat a smart breakfast, okay? Oh, I want us to actually order something. I want us to order some healthy snacks really quick. No, you're not having mac and cheese. I'm putting that back in the fridge. I don't care. I don't care what you have to say about it. Where are you putting it? Stop putting stuff on the window thing. Oh my gosh. Yeah, come order, please. I need to order some healthy snacks and hopefully they come in time. I'm not going to work and these people are not taking me seriously enough. Like no one is answering. Hi Gwen, good morning. We would like some healthy food delivered to us today. I want us to get some snacks. That's really what it is. This is by Somic and Severinka. Ooh, some dried fruit. We get some dried apple. Let's get some dried banana and some dried kiwi. Yeah, that's a good start. I just want something to pack into her bag, you know? Oh, we should get a protein bar. Coconut and vanilla sounds delicious. And a pistachio one. Let's get those. 
Hopefully they get delivered soon. And then, yes, you should absolutely drink some coffee. <laughs> yeah, she's like, can you come soon, please? And they're like, we'll come as quickly as we can, ma'am. We're doing our best. You're not going to work today. This is so unfortunate. Man, <laughs> we're really going to have to skip it. What do you mean we can't call in sick? Hi, Gwen. Oh, look at Gwen doing some yoga this morning. We love to see it. Oh, my alarm's going off. Why did no one tell me? Turn it off. Okay, and when you're done drinking your coffee, maybe you should take a quick shower to get ready for the day. I'm not going to work. <laughs> I feel bad, but I also kind of don't feel bad. Did we get anything overnight? We did. We got some Furium. We got a rose. Oh, we should absolutely go plant this rose. Yes, we should. Let's go plant it. Oh no, we need to spray for bugs and stuff. Oh no. Okay, why don't you come spray for bugs, please? And then plant this rose. Do we have a lily bush here? Plant this. Do we have a lily bush at all? I don't think so, but he's given us a couple lilies, j -Pets. So let's you know also oh that's my trash fruit right yes so we're gonna harvest everything after spraying for bugs and i want to weed this but i'm also hoping that our bestie does that because why else do we have a pumpkin man if he's not gonna do pumpkin man things you know i'm not gonna fix these he can water them himself oh no these ugh, these people they keep making drinks what did they make now charlotte made a shamrock sour no we're cleaning that up throwing that away thank you it's a bit excessive, you know? It's just a bit much. Girl, I love hearing you sing in the shower. It's the best thing in the world. Don't forget to brush your teeth before you have to go. Oh my gosh, is that the alarm again? Yeah, no, work is absolutely not starting at night. <laughs> I'm so sorry. I feel so bad. You simply can't. You can't brush your teeth. What's wrong? She's nauseous. Okay, well, it's okay. We have a chill pill. Take your pill. Where's my delivery? Oh, it's right here. Accept delivery. I guess we can't. Well, I hope you just drop it off at the door at some point. Please don't like take it away, you know, or like eat it. We need that for work today. We're busy right now. Could you just put it down on the floor? Or are you just gonna stand there and wait the whole time, Elizabeth? Oh, we're feeling confident. Oh, we're mad from the trash. Just hurry up and just get things going, you know? You don't have to think about how trashy and gross it is back there. Like, just just keep it pushing. She's hungry. We'll eat on set. Just hurry up. Okay, fine. You don't need to clean that up or brush your teeth. Can you come get the order, please? Thank you. Oh, she fi she left it. Well, thank you. Oh, oh, she's mad. I didn't give her a tip. Elspeth! Elizabeth! I'm sorry. Okay, well, it's too late to give you a tip now with a tip. Okay, well... Let's just open our delivery and then I will pack your bag for you while you clean this up. Clean it up and also brush your teeth. How's that sound? You put all the groceries into the fridge. Who asked you to do that though? Like who actually asked you to do that? Could you not? Okay. All right, fine. We will open this and now we have to open the fridge too or what? The, this is what I don't like, because now it closed the purse. All right, let's put some things in our purse. What do we want to take today? Today we could take, um, should we take dried fruit? I think that's a good idea. I hope it can go in the bag. It can. And let's take a protein bar. We'll try a pistachio one. Yeah. Let's open this and then boom, look at our little purse. We got a lemon. In fact, do we even need the lemon right now? We don't, we have our things. An apple a day keeps the doctor away, yes, but we have dried apples now and that's even better. So let's put this in our purse. And oh, thank you, JPeth. I know it's your last day, but you are going overboard for us. I appreciate you. Let's put some more trash fruit in there. I'm excited that I can use that. You're off to work? No, you're not. She made seven dollars, but see, at least she went. At least she went. You're not eating your dried kiwi. You have to... We have to go to set in 30 minutes. So, did you even get to brush your teeth? Can you come do that? We'll eat when you get to set, I promise. Oh my gosh, this girl. I know you're hungry, but like, this is just not the day for all this fussiness. Alright, why don't you come change into this, you know? 
and let's practice our acting in the mirror. I know you want to eat, but that's just not the vibe right now, all right? It's just not. JPEG, talk to her for me, please. She's not listening. She's so hungry. It's okay. I got your back. I promise. I promise you it'll be okay. Look, the frog is watching you. It will be okay. We need to get your fame up as well as your magic, okay? Here, practice your lines. Uh -huh. What are you even doing today? It's void critter thing. Void box. Cherry and whimsical character Good actor Buddha. needed. Oh, 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 cancel, cancel so that we can go. <laughs> we're here we're here we're at studio 58 that's what i'm gonna call it oh my goodness look the bernie mac show on the wall i'm so excited i'm so excited okay where do we start so we have to get into hair and makeup girl we are hungry where's the food where is the food we're gonna eat something real quick um what are our options right now chocolate chip cookies chips and salsa or pizza do y'all know it's nine o'clock in the morning what kind of behavior is this okay i guess we'll just let's grab that all right and i guess we'll just make our way over to hair and makeup well we'll eat first it's the morning they're probably having the morning meeting on set okay so while they have their you know the ad's talking to everybody and being like today we need to make sure we're safe on set we need to make sure that we are following proper protocol. Let's make sure that we are giving each other enough space on set and we're not in anyone's way. Allow camera to do their thing. We're gonna have um, set deck, you know, dealing with the stage up there. So let's try to avoid sitting up there. Our actors are getting ready for the day. We should be getting, camera should be rolling by 12 so let's make sure that we're efficient in everything we're doing okay absolutely absolutely we should okay let's get hair and makeup for our gig who's this i want to chat with raven who raven hooray media is this our hair and makeup person hi courtney could i please get into hair and makeup for the day i'm luna i am playing a void critter i think i'm the lead today and she's like, okay, if you think so, I'm pretty sure you just have a scene today or two, but that's fine. No, no, I'm the lead. Thank you. Oh, we took our hat off and everything. Yes, uh, our first gig, y'all. Oh, no. It is our first gig. Courtney, could you please make sure you make me look good? Make me look good. Make me shine. <laughs> um, Courtney's like, I'm gonna do what I'm gonna do. And that's that. You gotta tell her a story. We can tell her a story. Let's tell her an unbelievable story. Courtney, why would you do me like that? Uh, Courtney. Look, I have a potion in my bag and I'm not afraid to use it. Do you understand me? Please make sure that I look decent. I'm not playing with y'all. Okay, at least her face looks normal. What are you doing with my hair? Could you not cut my hair, please? Could you? It's a lot of spray. Is there a sustainable way to do this? Why does my hair need to look like that? Could you not put this dye on my hair? Oh, thank you so much, Gwen, for paying me 1600 in rent. Courtney, fix my hair. We don't have time. Like, I have to be on set at 12. This is why everything is always late. So you did all this for me to look exactly the same? Courtney, it's a bit excessive. You know what I mean? It's a bit, it's a bit much. I need to tell you some kind of story. He's like, girl, do you know I'm a witch? She's like, frogs and everything. She's like, what do you mean you're a witch? I'm a witch. I could turn you into a basketball. I could turn anybody into a basketball if y'all piss me off on this set. Okay? I found a way to live in my dream house. I have a bear living under my bed. And she's like, girl, you're capping. She's like, hey, I'm lying. But I am a witch though. As you can see, I have a JPEG here. Okay? So, just letting you know. We're waiting for costumes to call us. So in the meantime, we're just like, you know, talking. Eventually we're gonna hear on the walkie. Can, can we get uh, can we get Luna into costume, please? Is she in costume? They're gonna be like, no, she's still in hair and makeup. And the 80s are gonna be like, what do you mean she's still in hair and makeup? 
She needs to be in costume right now. Get her to wardrobe. What is Angelo doing? And they're like, Angelo's waiting for her. And it's like, has anyone communicated to her? No, no one has communicated it to her. Okay, could someone do that? So now she's going, now she's going. Like, I guess this is costume. Angelo? Hi, Angelo, could I get into my costume, please? And he's what like, yeah. He's like, okay, cool. Nice to meet you. I'm Luna, by the way. And he's like, I know who you are. Um, you don't have to be a jerk, Angelo. Do you understand? I eat people like you for breakfast. Oh, we've oh, he's mad because we've we've hooked up before. That's fair. Well, Angelo, could you just get this done so that I can go? Alright. What's up? I am a hot dog, Angelo. You don't have to be mad that I don't want to spend time with you romantically anymore but don't put me in bathroom slippers and a hot dog costume uh, in my first day on set this is a lot not that this is any much better okay let's go practice acting with the people we have an hour before we have to actually go to the stage so let's go over here we should practice acting in the microphone because we're that girl there's a lot of people here watching her play riley hedrick you're a global superstar? Then why are you BG in my production? You know? Oh, who's running? Is everything okay? Producer. Producer. So many producers here. Oh, Ebubi Okafo. Hi, my Nigerian king. So many producers. But look at them. They're all fawning over the biggest actor here when I need help and no one wants to help me. Hello? Mr. Tate? Oh, oh, look, this pretty uh, girl, you're the, you're the goat. Hi, Ibube. Give him a funny introduction. Give him a funny introduction. Just be like, hey, how did you get into the business? And he's like, well, when I moved here from Nigeria, I just, I love Nollywood and I just wanted to work in, you know, Hollywood and see how different it is from Nollywood. And she's going to be like, how does that feel? Like, is it that much different? He's like, yeah. He's like, you're really self-assured and she's like you too i love your hustle i love your story like i really respect like you know that you came out here and you're doing your own thing i did the same thing i came over here from um i came over here from uh what's it called from glimmerbrook and he's like what's glimmerbrook come compliment his empty humor he's like oh it's the land of witches he's like oh does that explain the little woo you got around you and she's like yeah it does it actually does She's like, I appreciate that you actually, like, talked to me today. Like, no one's really, like, talking to me. She's like, I really had to get in shape for this today. And I'm not sure why. What's up with the costume? And he's like, oh, you read your lines, right? The special effects operator is over here. Oh, now everyone wants to talk to me. Yeah, Riley? How's that feel? How's that feel? Hmm? Ooh. Look at that. You and Ebuwe are close. This is our favorite producer. The other ones are simply not giving. And this chicken suit man, Corey Hernandez, you're not giving. All right. It is 1148. We have to get to set in 10 minutes. So let's go talk to the director real quick. Or should we get something to eat? Let's get some more salsa quickly. Guys, cast is quickly getting a bite to eat, and then we're gonna go to set if that's okay. Let me take a look at the director and everything while she grabs a bite through her costume. Valentine Hobson, nice. And this is Tate, the producer, and Raven, the producer. Okay, so they're all talking. They're like, this Luna person, she's causing a bit of a stink back there. She's like, you know, she's all mad and jaded at the industry for some reason. Um, First of all, if y'all talk to her, you know the reason. Is that set deck? Sir, why are you talking to the bear? You know, he's probably just trying to make sure his angles are right. And Alisa, I love your fit. I love your whole vibe. I like everything about it. All right, we have to come talk to the director. It is 12.10. We are 10 minutes behind schedule. Um, let's throw him a respectful introduction and just be like, Nice to meet you, sir. Mr. Valentin, such a director name. It's like, I'm Valentin. Everyone's like, Val the director? Are you like a big director? Like, you're the one who picked me, so. It's like, hey, Valentin, nice to officially meet you. I'm Luna. He's like, oh, I remember your audition. You really didn't come to play. Like, I was 
very fascinated by everything you were doing. Right, She's like, thank you. Could I get some notes on the production? Is there anything you want me to do specifically? Because I did like my working out and stuff and I talked to people. And he's like, oh, just do everything that you did in the audition, but like just add a little bit extra to it. And she's like, okay, I can do that. I can do that. Okay, it's 1230. We got to go to camera now. I have to go to camera. So let's... Um, we're ready to perform. Okay, we're gonna obviously have to put JPEG away. Or not. So like, I don't know, could that be our little quirk as an actor that we always- Ma'am! Could you not do that to the bear? What's happening? Because you're mad? Is that Judith Ward? That's Judith Dawson. That is Judith Ward. Oh, she's with child. Hi, mama. Okay, well... Are we ready to act? We are. So what do we have to do? have to perform a dance scene and then show product scene yes let's review the script please okay do you feel ready camera is still getting set camera needs a moment camera is getting the angles ready okay cool so i think we feel should we do a safe dance let's just do exactly as we were told okay i would normally do a risky dance but like luna she's just trying to you know She's trying to make do. Right, j -Path? Let's do this. They're like, does the thing have to be up here? And she's like, yes, it's my emotional support. Familiar. Thank you. Yes. 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 I'm sorry. The director said, okay, that was pretty good. That wasn't bad. That wasn't bad. We have a silver. Okay. Um, We know we can sing, though. We know we can sing. So let's come try that. Let's come try singing real quick. Cause we know in the shower we're always body in it. Don't embarrass me. Yeah, wow, wow. Let's do it. Don't embarrass me. Come get some void critter boppies. A boppity's a boppity's a boppy. Let's sing together while we void critter boppy. Girl, you know you ate that up. You know you did. Okay, now let's come show this product safely. You know, let's not do too much. Let's not do too much. Yes, I believe in you. Come on, let's do it. All right. She is like, get the new Void Critter album. It'll blow you away. You will sing better than everyone around you if you practice with the Void Critters. We can't wait for you to sing along with us. Thanks for being a Void Critter girly and a Void Critter boy and a Void Critter everybody. Void Critter inclusive. And we got gold. <laughs> Look how confident we are. Look how confident we are. Look how confident we are. It's amazing. It's a dream. It's a gift. Let's even hang out on set for a little bit longer, you know? I'll put our bag down here so we can have a little snacky. Let's have a little snackaroo. Let's have our pistachio bar. Mmm. We love to see it. We love to see it. Oh my gosh. That was a great day on set, y'all. I wonder how much we're going to get paid. Probably nothing. Look, the producers are hyped. They're like, that wasn't bad. That was better than the last time. She's not bad. And the director's like, yeah, she's work she needs to work on her confidence a little bit. But like, you know, we got 475. We got 675. Let's stay on the lot. We got a bunch of follow. We got we have 1.4 million followers. We got 84,000 from this performance, and we've been promoted to background actor. <laughs> I'm sorry, Riley. What? <laughs> like what? <laughs> you think you know me, but you don't. Oh look, Ibubay's thinking about me. He's like, girl, that girl's performance was crazy. I want to see her on more sets. I know you do. I know you do. He was like, that was a really good job. You killed it. Thank you, Abube. I appreciate it. Is she flirting? Is he flirting? He's like, I really want you to work on other sets. Like, are you like available? She's like, yeah, yeah. I just work as a barista, but I've been trying to break my way into the industry. And like, this is, this is the way I think, you know, this feels right to me. But I just need to power through a lot of the attitudes in the industry. And he's like, he's like, it's okay. You just have to like, you have to keep trying. You have to be yourself. You know, I think it's really cool that you brought Jacob with you. And she's like, you're pretty good at your job. And he's like, don't embarrass me. Come on. Okay. But can we actually be done this conversation though? 
like I would like to go have my pistachio thing. Nurtual close -nex. You guys are getting real close. Rina Why is he talking to me all close like this? Bima. Why is he talking Mondero. to me all close? What are we huh. feeling about? Oh, we have good compatibility. Is that why? Oh, and she thinks he's attractive too. <laughs> well, baby, he's your boss, so we can't. It's a power imbalance you there. You're gonna give him a hug. Thanks for a great day. Thank you so much. I'm just gonna go have my pistachio wow, thing and call it a day. <laughs> Thank you. You're so cool. Thanks. Um, Luna, please come get your purse. Luna? Luna? I don't think Luna wants this pistachio thing. I'm um, also, because it would be better next time. Thank you so much. All right, looks like we're not getting that. Let's go home then. He has a great reputation. Everyone loves attending social events that she hosts. Oh my God, Trisha is sending us a message. So much is happening. Hold on. Take a little selfie because it's our first day on set next to the garbage. Yes. Just kidding. Yes, actually, we should do it next to the garbage. Uh -huh. Garbage girlies. Yes. <laughs> Look at Luna standing in front of the little set. She's too cute. Stop. I love this little city set. Um. Anyway. All that being said, y'all, that will be the end of today's episode. We did it. We did it. She finally had her first gig. It was only like $600 or 600 simoleons. But you know what? We did it. And that's all that matters. We're super proud to be alive, to have done it, to be capable, and to have made a great connection. Even that little text we got at the end that was saying, oh, I'm happy you got to know April, but he seems like he's a good person to know. You know what? That person's probably like, yo, that's a good producer. He's an up and comer. So let, let's keep in our in our back pocket. I'm a little happy. I'm a little giddy. I'm very excited. This was a great episode. Thank y'all so much for watching. You know what I have to say. Get out of my house. Put your shoes back on. Keep the dust bunnies back off your toes. Close the door behind you because Simoleon says, see you later. Bye. Yo, yo. Who lives in a pineapple under the sea? SpongeBob SquarePants. Absorbing in yellow and porous is he? SpongeBob SquarePants. His medical something is something you wish. It's something you wish. It's something you wish. So flop on the deck and flop like a fish. Like a puffer. Like a yo. SpongeBob Squidward SquarePants. Yo. He's in a pineapple, yo. Where? That's under the sea. Yo. Under the sea, you can see. When he's better than me, no, cause I'm on top of my things, cause I'm on top of my peas. Getting in racks, swinging it up, grabbing them patties, you see. He works in a Krabby Patty. <laughs>